the, the overproduction of PhDs, like this is a long-standing problem that has been discussed forward and backward. Uh, and the like, I, I think most most people who I've talked to about this agree that this is driven by the need for cheap researchers. Um, so a lot of this bringing in grants depends on how quickly you can churn out papers. Uh, and the more students uh, and the more young postdocs you have that you can put in cheap positions, uh, the better. Uh, and so you see this in a lot of institutions that I've seen this with my own eyes. Actually, I, you know, I was one of them, is that you hire uh, students, uh, young postdocs, you put them on these super cheap jobs, they produce their three papers, uh, you kick them out. But for, for most of them, there are no positions to land on. You know, there are just not sufficiently many jobs. Uh, and the reason this doesn't change is that the the people higher up in the hierarchy, like the, the professors, especially the younger ones, they need these people to produce all these papers. Uh, so, and I think this is why this isn't changing. Uh, I don't really know what to do about it. I'm just telling you, I, I think uh, that that's what's going on. 